is Shay Ziga, and I work at Sandia National Labs, and I'm married to Sam Ziga, who also works at Sandia National Labs. I grew up in a family um, that was really loving. I grew up with my mom and my grandma. People called us the Godsey girls. We were really close. And my mom and my grandma both had this really unique way of loving people unconditionally, even though they, they weren't believers. Um, they, they were both recovered alcoholics. So I started going to church in middle school, but I really, I really was going to church just kind of to check a box on my long list of things that made me look good in other people's eyes. And it was really tough to go through like so many transformative years not really having something grounding me. So I went on like a Christian conference thing over the Christmas break my freshman year. There was one night in particular at that conference that the speaker was talking about how if you're sinning with no remorse, that you're callous to your sin, and it might be a sign that your heart really hasn't been changed by the gospel, that you might not really have a relationship with Christ. For me, that really hit home. I was like, man, that's exactly what I've been doing. You know, I've been going to church on Sunday after like partying all night on Saturday and saying I'm I believe in something that I'm not actually living my life in response to. I'm always looking at the next step and always trying to prepare myself and thinking ahead. And so I think in this season of life in particular, I think the Lord's really been teaching me to be present and that that's what being on mission means. It's not always about looking to the next step because I think you can get so focused on the future that you kind of miss what God's placed beside you today. I mean, it can be in the everyday throes of life. It's, you know, making coffee with your husband in the morning. It's my coworker that I share an office with. Just being present in the now, that's what being on mission is. 